Morning guys, got a package in the post today. Oh my god, have I hell been having trouble with these. So they don't send out replacement um, um, with, the, with the keyboard. So basically, uh, um, I had a guy message me. Um, one sec, bear with me a minute. Uh, called Graham Watson. Um, thank you so much for your information, mate. That didn't work. Um, so I contacted them and I basically let rip at them. Um, basically, it's because it's not compatible with Windows 10, or it's got a fault with Windows. You know, work on Windows 10. So, of course they wanted me to send back the keyboard as well, and what they wanted me to do was send it back, but on top of that write them a letter why I'm sending it back, write my address, and there's a few other things. I'm thinking, no other company does this. And uh, no, this is not the same top as I've been wearing the other ones, I've got a few of these. Um, I've been sticking it on because it's so warm out, uh, white tops are really like top to be wearing. Um, and they're like, yeah, we don't send that replacement mouse. So I'm, I'm so I was like, fine. It was just gonna be cheaper for me to um, cheaper for me just to not send it back and, and find a, a game mouse. So I found one. I was like spot on. It's, un, uh, it's like seven under seven pound fifty. When I, when I found out it was from the same company, I'm thinking, oh, "Hold on, mate! You've just told me you don't do mouses separately. That is a mouse separately." Um, so I said that to them, and they wanted me to send them the ID number. I didn't know what I didn't know where it was. I had a friend look, didn't know where it was, so I gave them it. I had a message back from them this morning, telling them the same. I apologize for being all crappy and stuff for them, because um, I was a bit rude. But um, off the net, this is uh, she. She said hi, thank you. However, this is not the same mouse. It is only the same brand. No, it looked looked like the exact same mouse. This is not a replacement for this set. I'm sorry, but we will need to get the whole set back. So I've just replied to her saying, nah, not going to happen. After they tell her, I said they're going to send out a replacement one. So, um, I don't know where that's my, it's there, so let me quickly scoop myself. Um, yeah, so, uh, oh god, I was getting really, 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 really crappy with them. Got pull drunk. Um, so basically, oh, be back in a sec, guys. Sorry about that, guys. It was to do with Bibles and stuff like that, and I normally hate that sort of stuff. But we actually had a really good talk because we were talking about how the green Greenfield Flats and caught fire and stuff like that and about how the government are not right and about how the government are planning on taking money from the air ambulance they're planning on taxing the air ambulance anything to get more money in their pockets really aggravates me really aggravates me like to the point where I want to go nuts but anyway we got a parcel I've covered up the bits so we don't need to see um, We'll open up and see what it is. Um, I haven't ordered anything. Apart from those LEDs, but I don't think that'd be them yet, because they're coming away over from um, China, I think it is, something like that. So that's, um, get us opened up. Oh crap, do do it? Jack, if you want chocolate milk, mate. You can tie the lounge. I was outside for like five minutes and you made a complete mess inside. How is that even possible? 
the hell? Looks like this has been sellotaped. Right, go close the fridge for me, and I'll sort this out for you. Sorry about this, guys. Uh, down there. Right. Well, let's see what this could be. Seriously? Right, guys, you're not you're not gonna believe this. You're also not gonna believe this. Not a, not one that I wanted. Uh, hold on. There we go. No. I. I. Uh, oh my god, no words. I was sure no words. So basically, the other one didn't. Basically, the other one didn't work because it had problems with Windows 10. So. If this was the one that I wanted, I would have bought it. Look, look at that! It may do, it may actually light up. So okay. Um, how do you get into this thing? Ah, oh, here you go. But yeah, the guys at the door, one of them actually, who is, I don't want to say a Bible basher because it sounds horrible, but one of the guys there was actually a paramedic and actually dealt with my, um, oh, are you kidding me? Oh, seriously? Um, dealt with my partner at the time, which I was shocked about. Oh my God, are they still doing these? Are they still doing them? Oh, you! That was full of static. Nice red wire. Um, it actually feels, actually feels quite, actually really heavy. Actually, that's that's nice. I like that. Um, that's. Well, let's plug it in and find out, shall we? See what happens. I'm not going to plug it in to the back yet because, well, let's face it, given my luck, it's going to stop really working. So, if we quickly, I don't know if you can see, plug them in there. Well, that's not very impressive, is it? That's not very impressive at all. I mean, yeah, okay, it, it does that, but that does the side ones. Okay, okay, okay. Which one does that do then? Um, well. If I got the side ones red, I'm gonna want I'm gonna want that one um, red as well. So look okay. here. Right, yeah, I got a mouse. That's a good start. Um, that's obviously um, the scroll up and down. Oh, got a message back off them. Let's see what it is. That's page back. That's page forwards, which is the side buttons. That's pretty cool. Um, if I click the middle scroller button and I just hold it down, it will go down by itself, as you can see, both my hands. So that's that's all good. So let's um let's have a look to see what these have to say, shall we? Because 
I'm gonna be ready to be angry again. It's it's um really does not bother me. Oh my god, this is. Uh, they need to communicate. Right, so they've sent me an updated one, but you're zoomed doing more. But I don't want this to glow different colours, I want it to glow red. Oh, what the hell? Apparently, I'm doing stuff today. That's blue. How the hell would you stop that turning colour? There's nothing underneath there. I remember when I was in school. Um, yeah, you're probably going to say I'm old now, but I'm, I'm not. Um, you used to have a thing you can take off. That, that used to be a ball inside instead of a laser. Um, and I used to take the balls out, <laughs> put the cover back on, and then... Um, Wait for people to try and use it, but yeah, it's working good. Apart from, I don't want it to keep changing color. I don't, I don't understand. But it is the same as it is the same. Like that there is the same as that, and game max and game max. So we can actually go ahead and disconnect this mouse now and plug it straight into the back where it was um, originally meant to be plugged into uh, what have we got here DPI select able 500 to 2500 DPI gaming sensor um, program with some, some buttons backlit logo three colors one Two, three, four. I wouldn't say that was the back of the colour, but then because uh, like, uh, that one. So how do I lock? All right, let's let's try and get you in on this action tree. Let's try and get you in some of this action so I can see what's going on. That. Of course, it's going backwards. Alright, so default button config left click mouse button, right click mouse button, scroll wheel, middle button, resolution, resolution increase DPI, resolution decrease DPI, next web page, previous web page, um, USB, optical, uh, have a go. I think that is 50 50. I don't, I just need to know how to stop the colours changing, I don't want it to be changing colour. Um, so let me, uh, let me go on and see, let's see what these again, let me go on and have a look and see what we got here. I'm going for a red theme, so obviously I'm going to it in red, you'd think, anyway. Right, um, it did come up with a driver here somewhere. So, let's see if it's still here. Of course it's not. Uh, connection, is that for the internet or is that for your PC mobile device? Support my... America so it can protect wirelessly. Uh, your PC mobile device doesn't support... Zero. Oh, right, okay. I don't care, I just need that to stop changing colour. How do I stop it changing colour? Um, right, point being is, it's here. It's working. The other mouse can either get sold on or chucked. More than likely chucked. So I'm going to disconnect it here. Oh crap, sorry guys. I can't see what you're doing here. Okay. So I'm going to need to take this one off.
I'm going to need to find the keyboard mouse. Um, key keyboard mouse? That does not even make sense. Well, that's the keyboard one, so then I want that one there, which is for the mouse. Which is all over the place. I just burnt myself on these LEDs. Fantastic. You can't see what I'm doing here. Let me um, be up on the desk here. Very red, sorry. Right, so that's that one. So now we want this one to go into this one. It's just a USB USB extender. That's what it is. So we take that one out. I'm gonna put this white one in which is for my LED we'll push that one back in there and we'll push that one in there and we'll just follow it along like so until we get to that bit there ow, oh, just burnt myself on that LED again right, that's not going to work like that so that needs to be like that right, have I got a mouse? I have, oh my god, Jesus Christ, have I got a cursor? Yes, I have. So now I'm going to put this one back in, make sure it follows the groove out. Put it back into place. Oh, that PGL place, yeah, they never rang back. Not surprised enough to the attitude I gave them, but when I get told, I'm going to get a phone call back on on the, the same day, and I don't get one. Uh, what the hell do they expect? Do they expect me to be nice? Uh, yeah, pals, I don't think so. Somehow. <sighs> oh well, you only live once. But that's that. My old. My old mouse was a gigabyte one. Um, I'm obviously going to keep it because it's a good mouse. It is a really good mouse. And now I've got my new one, which is awesome. Just need to sort out some of this wiring because the wiring's everywhere. So I can just wrap it up back there if it needs to be. Like that. Uh, this wire here needs, well, let's say stretching out. But it's a nice, nice reddish kind of curtain on it, red and black. And I've still got a cursor. I don't know if you can see that. Total cursor. Let me just click on something so you can see I've still got a cursor there. So that's awesome. Oh, let's watch this. This is going to be something awesome, isn't it? Let me turn up. Oh, wow. I've got all respect for lorry drivers, but not when they give everyone a bad name like that. Never mind. But yeah, this, this, oh my god, Jesus. This mouse just feels, oh sorry, I got a sort of really bad ingestion. Just, you feels nice. So, I'm going to click that one there. And then that one. So, that one. That puts back on page. And the uh, next one, oh, it's not there now. Okay, never mind. Um, what am I? What am I looking at here? Oh yeah. So, I had the bin men turn up um, today. They obviously was not happy with the amount of bins that there were. Well, maybe if you come and actually empty it, then it wouldn't be like that. So, let me show you a picture. Well, I'll tell you what. Let me show you the video first of all. This is the video, CCTV footage. He's only a young chap. Uh, he'll give himself a little complaint in a minute. 
he'll look back and point and freaking open his arms up like, you know, what the F. Well, mate, shut up. It's part of your job. Get on with that. There we go. See? Like, you know, what the hell. And, of course, the lorry driver himself is a knob. He reverses in like it's nothing. He 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 will he must put pe pedal to the metal driving reversing in. I've driven an art deck, I know what it sounds like driving back. Um he drives it back fairly quickly. So this guy isn't the yeah, this is the uh driver. As you can see he was kicking a bin. So that's that's um he he was he was kicking the bin and he'll probably end up if you watch him you'll see him chuck stuff over here. Oh that, oh that's that. So let me just pause that there for just just oh I said pause that and it, it went back to the beginning. Um chuck stuff over. Yeah, so pause it there. So let me come back off this a second and move this. And let me um show you what was left. Hmm, yeah. Next one? Mm, yeah, okay. Yeah, I see. Um, basically that uh, we end up having to pay extra on our rent to get that bean, bean? that bin cleaned. The council are probably not going to like the fact that I'm sharing this on YouTube, but I've contacted them. They are going ahead with you know complaints and stuff like that. They have been nice about it. There was right here, though. right here. Here's all the mess. There is no reason whatsoever for them not to pick it up. If you made the mess, pick it up. We can't help the bins are over overfilled within two days. There's eight flats, plus four flats up. Oh, you can't see my cursor. Um, these buildings here are shops. Oh, these buildings here are like shops. That's like a healthcare place, and that other one over there is shut down. This here is a door to lead to not one, not two, but four flats above the shops. So you've got all of them as well. And you can see the time. It's uh, 7.58. I said it was about 8ish, I think it was, when they come get it. That's accurate time because that's today because I took, took it off. Wednesday. Uh, today is Wednesday. It's 12th July, which is Wednesday. And as you can see, he's um, putting stuff back in in the um, bin, which is like all the other bin bags that they had lying around. So, they're doing that. The driver kicks it inside. So, of course, spreading it everywhere. Uh, not giving a crap that he's just made a mess and that our rent's going to go up because of it. So, he's picking up stuff there now, which you've seen a picture of. It's from a mess. He's now going to whinge like a little biatch because he's got water on him. It's rained. What does he expect? He's just put a bin upside down. What does he expect? So, basically, they'll take that now. Oh, God, it's going to be bad injection just talking about it because I'm getting mad. Um, they'll take it. Mates will bring the bin back, we'll start picking up all this mess, and the driver will be like, Don't worry about it, just get in, let's go. So, mate will pick up the last couple of bin bags and uh, they'll go. So, I've contacted Devon County Council, as in, I'm in, because I'm in Devon in the UK. Um, they're taking this quite seriously because I'm quite often out there cleaning it up, so we're not having to pay. Um, you know, for something that was not our fault. So of course he's there picking a couple of things up. You know, not a lot. Got the driver. Well, you got the guy, other guy over here bringing the bomb bin back. Here's the driver here. The driver's here. So once he finishes bitching around with his lorry, just Jack, shush him at me. He comes back, and he'll be like, No, 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 don't worry about that. There's no volume or then, but you can just see it in his hands. Yep, see? Nah, don't worry about that. Let's just go. Can't be piss assing around with what I've just spread around with my foot. Dickhead. 
So Matey grabs the last couple of bin bags and um, chucks it in the back and then you will see them leave. Um, so I made sure of that. Jack, hold on please. Um, I've, I've edited it just up to the bit where they arrive and where they leave. Go on. Wait, please. Um, and as you see they leave. And I am beyond pissed. I'm beyond pissed with it because we will now have to either we'll have to fight it up or we'll get charged extra. So I basically got onto the phone, I got onto the blower for the one. Wait, no, stop. Stop. I'm talking. Stop being so rude. Another rude one. So basically got on the phone to the got on the phone to him and I said I want the driver to come back. I've got proof here, I've got CCTV and I've got pictures, so I'll send you pictures as well. She said, oh no, no, that's great, thank you very much, I'm glad that this and the other, I can totally understand that you um, are not happy with this, as in, because it puts our rent up. And I said, well, would you be, personally? Would, would you be happy with one month that your rent's gone up because you're you're having to pay someone to come in to clean it? What they're meant to do? It's their job. Um, but... That's that. But anyway, guys, I thought I'd show you the package and stuff like that. I still don't know why it's going multi colours, but it's it's a mouse and it works. So we've got a full game mouse now. So um, I'll probably get on in a bit and sort out some of this wiring. So uh, yeah, I just got to sort my children out, and then I'll be right with you. I can't say what time it will be because um, I've got a lot of other stuff to do as well. Got, um, if right, I've right. Just hear me out here. Right, this PGL all sorts. I think they are the PGL all sorts. I don't want to be dissing the wrong freaking company here. Yeah, PGL all sorts. Let's give me swearing on this now, by the way. Um, the, he has completely fucked me off. I rang up and I ordered a 4 kVA. 4 kVA, which means it should be 4,000 watts. Not under, no more. He gave the whole bullshit. Oh, I've worked I've worked my own bounce gas for business for 10 years, this and that and the other. Um, it's not what it is. That should not be able to power a um, 1.5 horsepower blower, which is 1,100 watts. He is full of shit. He has no idea what he's talking about. So of course me and my partner argued because I've just gone and ordered a generator that's a 4 kVA. So we've argued. She didn't understand what I was on about. That's why we argued. So I went on to I spoke to my friend that he runs another bounce gas company like uh, an hour away from me. Um, I just basically wanted to gather up all the evidence because I know I'm right. I'm not saying I'm always right, but I'm right with this. Um, he went to my he went to my supplier for my bounce castles, the actual boss I spoke to, and he said that should run a two horsepower blower, not a one point five horsepower blower, a two horsepower blower. Piece of piss, his words. So he said, it's not what it says it is because it's come with the wrong labels, or um, there's something wrong with that. Same thing I said. Of course, PGA all sorts man argues with me, and I tell myself, "Then please explain to me then how I was able to run a um, 1.5 horsepower blower." It struggled, but off a 2.8 kVA um, generator. He just tells said it won't work. Um, spoke to my friend. He runs his 1.5 5 horsepower blower off a 3.2 or 2.8 kVA and he said it runs it at drag. Move away please, keep knocking the camera. Let's run up here. Um, he said it runs it piece of piss. Right, stop. Stop being so rude. So, I've, I've done this business for 10 years. I've, well, I've got 10 years experience. I know what I'm talking about. He has no clue what he's talking about. 
we've all come to the conclusion that is it yes yeah, it's, it's a Nielsen one um, he swears by Nielsen he's got like 15 years of dealing Nielsen and whatnot he swears by them so when I had the generator turn up filled up with fuel to test it out it's got handles perfect that's from back picked up oh and what you want to say hi his face is because he's had breakfast this morning say hi then say hi then say hi then um, basically um, it pissed up the fuel cap and the fuel gauge worse than Niagara Falls yeah worse than Niagara Falls so if you know where I can get seals for them please send me a link because I'm struggling because I don't want to go back to them plus I give them shit so anyway I'm gonna sort this out in a bit and I'll see you then hi oh, guys it's going to be a bit of that <clears throat> bit of this and bit of that um, I went to work all day I left at 10 got to where I need to be at 11 and so he's my French and then there was dog shit there because was that truck running for it so it took me half I need. I left that because I wanted to fix my bus castle so it took me half an hour to go around just to check all the areas where the castle is going to be and stuff excuse me I'm so tired <sighs> to um check you know to see if it's all right and stuff and then it took me another I want to say 20 minutes 20 minutes to um, fix the castle oh, I'm just so tired so I'm meant to be there for 12 finish at 6 yesterday we didn't get back home until about half 9, 10 o'clock at night I'm scared I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm scared. Um, Havley is actually just on the road for us. It's probably less than a 15 minute drive, and I had to stop. <laughs> what? Alright, hold on. It took. Pardon me. 45 minutes to get home from there because I kept stopping. Oh crap, because I kept stopping. Because I had to, because I had to try and wake myself up. I was going to crash. Tomorrow is another hectic day. Uh, can't complain if I didn't have the work, then I'd be complaining. So. Um, but they're not planning on being there. It's for christenings and all that. So if I remember, I'll bring you guys with me. And then we'll set up the um, the number twelve and the six by six. So basically, that'll never begin set up. And that'll never begin set up. And then you would see the air uh, jugglers first hand. That's of course if I remember to bring you guys. I'm just so tired, I don't even know what to do with myself. Excuse me. It's quarter past nine now, so... I've um, written to this one other person about the booking and she hasn't gone back to me and I'm worried she's coming over and on the blacklist. But then she may work nights, so I don't, I don't know. Sophie could have done it if she actually listened to me, but she didn't. Um, yeah, she doesn't remember it. Um, but she didn't listen to me, so, you know. 
my first February in it. But apart from that, we're um, we good to go. So I'm going to put you guys in charge. Um, I don't know what left on this. Uh, it says we've got over 10 hours of raining. Battery ain't gonna last that long. <laughs> anyway, guys, um, hopefully, I'll be a bit, bit weak. As you can see, I'm struggling to get my words out as I was saying. I'll see you tomorrow, and hopefully, we'll go from there. Hey guys, well, it's Sunday today. Um, I have just been absolutely crazy busy. So we're at our second, second, we're at our first booking, but I'm hoping it's in the main. Yeah, it is. So. She showed me a picture of that. So I think she said she wanted the castle on the right and the ballpark on the left. I'm not sure. I'll have to. I'll have to look that up and have a see. But um, I'll extend this. So extend this or extend your legs. I don't know if I'm going to do a fast forward in of it for you. Um, who knows? But I'm bringing you along to one of my jobs again, so that's, that's exactly what I'm doing. So if I get you set up there, then you'll see everything that's going on. And then I've got to wait here, so I've got to drop down time and then um, go from there. Oh, 
was not a great start. So I brought it to the back, which is the newest one that I've got. Let me just go grab a bit of fly lead. Brick sense. If you've got a bad back, it's not just doing this. But I'll give up for sake. This is that up. Let me try this for you. Oh. This one's new, it shouldn't be freaking messing up in there already. That's a very good start. Oh, for God's sake, I was only using this thing yesterday. Stay on P, it'll be kind of nice though. I'm so annoyed. I'm going to go grab the tools. Oh, this is annoying me. This is. Yeah, she did, and swear. You are not proud of so she's fine, no. Oh, I'm not a bucket. She's been a bucket now, but I'm going to have to use my patch of broth for. But I'm going to have to stay there for that. Hold on. Oh, <laughs> that'll be sketched out then. Hold on. So, I'm going to want to guess they've turned the trips off for the sockets. Question is though, where, this, where are the trips are going to be? Sketch me out here. Let me get my coat on there. Follow the This is going to be lighting. It is indeed, it's going to be lighting. Right. What in the hell? 
help. What's going on here, man? How trips it is. Please check that all lights are off. That's not it. Oh, no, that's not it. Where the hell are the trips, would you say? I'm confused. I'm confused. You guys might not be able to see any of this because I've obviously got to. That's what he is. I've obviously can't video um, our kids in here. Seriously. Wrong keys. Where the hell are my keys to? They're on the table, aren't they? What the? Seriously, what the hell, man, is going on here? I just freaking out, I just thought it's a freaking socket to back anyway, so... I'll put that back in. This one back up. If I can. Why would you have a socket to... Why would you turn the trips off? I mean, unless it's been tripped by accident, why would you turn them off? This one That's the bed of the bone, All I'm seeing is the key meter put in. Please don't tell me they have to put. Please don't tell me they have to put freaking electric in for it to start working. Because that's just absolutely bloody stupid, you know? That's just utterly ridiculous. Just so I can't get them to do what I need to do. Simple as that, really. I can't just try to really. Well, I now don't believe it's my my gear, so my gear can get out. All fun stuff can come in. That's that sort of stuff can come in, but can't go up because you know socks don't work. This is the first time I've been here, so. Yeah, my missus decided to come here. Yeah, you're good. My missus decided to not get here until, well, decided to come until like late. So I was like, no, it's not off. You're not going. What's this? This thing to keep the door open. If it is, it doesn't work very good. Look at that. This thing to keep the door open. I would say no. Oh well, it's fine. Most of it's in now. So we have lights, sort of, just nothing else. Because, yeah, that makes perfect sense. Do you want to use 
Can you know, fix that stuff? Turn it on because you know. Nothing, absolutely nothing. I'll turn. I have reverse. Right. I can't have it there because it's a fire door. So it's going to come over here. That's also a fire door. Give the glance councils. If you think you can just come in and deliver wherever, wherever you like, think twice. You cannot block the fire door, which seems to be locked, by the way. Uh, another potential fire door, which seems to be locked, which looks like you can go outside and look up. So, before you go blocking stuff, which is here, this will get enough fire exit. So, before you go blocking anything, think twice first. It's got you that's going to be here if um, stuff catches fire, it's going to be the case. And the adults. Me and my company, I run off safety first. If you don't like that, don't watch this. If you're not a safety guy, then go ahead and kill yourself. But don't do it on my channel, thanks. Because I'm not interested. Per usual, I cannot do that. I can't even put the balls in. This is ridiculous. This is utterly ridiculous. How is that? I don't, I don't think you would have caught that on camera, but there's this wrong rumbling sound. Here, sometimes pops off because it's not meant for this. Yes, that's not pop off. It's not meant for this blower. Oh, Jesus, I just cannot be space. Um, I need to either buy a blower, which is about £120 for it, or build a bigger cone for it. I'm heading towards building a bigger cone for it because, well, you know, cheaper. And quicker. Well, I wouldn't say quicker, but cheaper almost definitely. I hate it when it comes to the balls and ball because oh, it's just such a nightmare. <laughs> and then I'm kind of got past with it. Again, wire, do not want it going across the floor really, because the fire exit, no choice, it's where they want it, not going to do it. This is me before I set the castle up, just, just you know, me just bring stuff in, okay? This one's here, yeah, I'll show you the thing in a minute, but, oh. see if this key works. Rain. 
Vince knows it fairly easy. It's all seen, his brother's meant to be the same. They were meant to be. And that's all they lived happy ever after. I don't know if you hear me, but probably not. So I like most people don't want to listen to me anyway, so. If you um, heard surrounding this video, that would be yes because of that um the whole plug situation. Which had me freaked out with the blower. Which is fine because it wasn't. Good. But you know, I would love one that so I could dry it out. No. Not one about the people that that's high the space, one about the people that own the space. It's got a lot of ideas. So I'm now gonna go get sandbags for that thing. And then I'm gonna go get sandbags for the bounce kettle. That's apparently how it's gonna be. Right, sort of sound like some ball. Ball! Those bags aren't cheap either. You can't just buy one, you'll buy four. In which case, they're 10 quid each. And they're quite crap. I'm going to have a bunch In these bags here, you've got two, 15. Oh, that's not going down. Woo! You've got two 15 kilogram play sandbags. Some, some people don't know this. Let me reach up a little bit. If you just go for the normal. Normal sand, whatever. If the kit gets into that, because like the one bringing in now, I've poured sand into instead of leaving them in the sandbags. It was only since then I've started leaving them in the sandbags. But they start leaking the sand. The sand's already falling, the kids start playing with them. If it's not play sand, what do you think is going to happen? It's going to blind your child. What's the first thing going to do? They're going to come to you to sue you. You can then go back to wherever you got it from, in my case Argos, and tell and say, well, I bought play sand off you, why the hell is it hurting these kids' eyes? Okay, and safety first, guys. And this is the one which is obviously got hardly a sand in. Doesn't matter too much with bounce gas because it's a light one. Just make it secure down. But again, I can't do nothing with great power. And I have no idea where they will have everything. Don't go wrong, they've done lovely with this place. They really have. I mean they've got lovely blooms. Like lovely blooms. What an awesome cake. I mean, that is so nice. It's a beautiful looking cake. Let's go to Gan out here. We're going to the skill alley bit. Which will crack. Which then, once well, you got the bottom end of it as well. Uh, post office use only. And then you've got this bit here. You have to put money in. So, I'm going to put money in. Hopefully, it takes a quid or whatnot. Just so I can set up. Just so I can frickin' set up. I'm, I'm pissed off about it. Anywhere you rent a hall. We should not put bloody money in it. Frickin' joke.
that's now a charge you could use in the down for black box. You can't put money in, it's got to be tokens. So I can finish setting up and talk about token. Fabulous. <sighs> Nothing. So guys, it looks like that's going to be it. Um, you've got more to this video as well, I cannot remember what was on it. It's from like a couple of days ago, I can't see. It's from like a couple of days ago, so... I guess we'll have to leave it there, guys, because there's nothing else we can do. Um, I'll put a token in. Don't know why I didn't see it in the first place. It says token. Um, at the moment, it's not spinning. Therefore, we have no... F Excuse me, French fucking electric. And they expect me to put a bounce castle up and a ball pool. A ball pool where man that's got to stay up as the ball's going to go everywhere. I'm not mad at the customers, I'm mad at the people, oh crap, I'm mad at the people that, um, that own this hall, it's a, that's a joke, I mean really, so I'm now going to have to wait here for a little bit, and until quarter past, oh, what's the time here, yeah? I'm going to have to wait here now until about quarter past twelve, I think it was, they said they'll come in, What's the time here? <laughs> oh, the droids, eh? What does he mean on that? So you see the time? Yeah. I'm not having to wait to quarter past twelve for them to turn up. I, if I knew that um, they needed tokens and stuff out, they, why didn't they leave me one? Or if I knew if I knew they need tokens, freaking they should have just I should have just left it on time. I don't guys. Anyway, that's it. I'm I'm gonna lose. Sorry for my French, but I'm gonna lose my shit with this and that. It's really proper wound me up. I've got another book in that one, I think it is. So I'm gonna go head off and do that once I've done this. I'm not gonna show you that one because um, people complaining stuff and. You know how it is. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Um, hope you enjoy this video. I can't remember what's the beginning of this video, so it's been a couple of days since, and I don't do good in my memory. So let me fold your legs back up. But yeah, if you're if you're about to cast a guy, uh, have you ever been to a place where they've left you with no electric set up? If they have, could you please get in touch? Because it would be interesting to hear your side of the story as well. Does it annoy you? Is it okay? Um, yeah, I've got to wait here anyway, because I hand the key in, but the point being is, I'm, I'm going to be here even longer now, because I have to try and drive the castle off. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, and I'll see you tomorrow, maybe. What day is it? Tomorrow, Monday. Monday, tomorrow. So, probably tomorrow. I don't know, I've got tons of stuff to do to this car, so... Oh yeah, I say tons of stuff. What side? Come on, let's be looking on. So, my missus wants me to fix it up, so... Okay. So I decided demolishing this. She's like, don't do that! I said, if my dad went on it with a hammer, it'd be worse. And she went, yeah, yeah, okay. And then I was at another booking. <laughs> uh, where's it gone? I was at another booking. It's over here somewhere. And I've seen a rust patch, like, here. I was like, right, okay, boot it, I booted it, and BAM! There goes a huge hole. So, basically what I'm going to do is, you can't see me very well, why is that? Is that better? Is that better? Is that better? Basically, basically I'm going to, you know, keep grinding it until it goes solid. Square it up, make a plate. Well in place, grind it down, and then um, 
body filler it and then spray it either with paint that's similar to it that's from metal just to protect it or I don't know if my missus wants to find the code on this and go all out and uh, buy paint considering we've got um, got like a rust splash there and there's all very little and stuff like that and all stuff it's an old car it's a very old car but we need it to last because it does both so and obviously you've got more there and whatnot. Can't see any more, but this door doesn't even look like a shunt probably. But anyway guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow hopefully.